you better get the job done here. Don't be one of these guys that comes in. <laughs> like the New York Mets have these guys come in. They're great players. They come play for the Mets. They suck. We can't tolerate that this year. Uh, I don't plan on doing that. <laughs> he doesn't plan on doing that. You enjoying New York thus far? I am. Yeah, it's, uh, when do you guys start? 16th. The for, 16th. For real, yeah. Well, you have a real game in the September 16th? Is a real no, game? No, it's no, a training camp. camp. Oh, training camp starts. Now, have yeah. you been exposed to this Tortorella yet or no? They're buddies. Oh, well, yeah. We, oh, uh, no. Are you guys friends? I used to do that camp uh, for seven, seven or eight years, I guess, back in Tampa. So. Listen. They he, won a Stanley Cup together. He's afraid of me, this guy. Is it? And he, I, if everyone says he's a man's <laughs> yeah. man, deathly afraid of me, little old me. Does that make any sense to you? No. What's, what's he afraid of? I don't know. He's not afraid of you. He's afraid me. of coming no, in not. here and saying hello. I don't get it. Uh-huh. Well, I don't get it one little bit. Well, you know, I think it may have something to do with the fact that you wanted him fired after oh. uh, they lost the playoff <laughs> wow. round to the Washington Capitals when he decided to sit Sean Avery, your buddy as uh-huh. well. I love Sean Avery. He's my guy. Uh-huh. It's your guy? He's my guy. Sean and I, very close friends. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, that's right. That's yeah, okay. right. Got a lot um, in common. So what's it like? Uh, obviously, uh, this, what is this, your third NHL team now? Uh, Dallas, of course, uh, Tampa prior to that, and now New York. Uh, is New York everything you thought it was? I know you haven't really started playing it, but yeah. I know you, you've moved here, and you're living here, so you're enjoying the city. But is New York, uh, the, the, the perception you have prior to getting here, does it live up to it? Is it more than that? What is it for you? Uh, it's probably more. I mean, there's a lot, a lot going on here. Um, you're going to have to uh, control all that and uh, figure out how the city works, but... Uh, you know, this part of it, it's tough to say because this part of it is not what I want to do. I want to be playing, and I can't right. wait to get playing. And uh, I'm excited to play in Madison Square Garden and do all that stuff. That's when it's going to get fun, and that's uh, that's what why I came. But uh, this has been fun getting to know the city, moving here, and, uh, you know, hopefully it uh, just gets better on the ice. You, you um, For hockey fans that don't realize this, you know, Brad is one of the, the best centers in, in hockey, and – uh, there was talk about maybe Dallas would have traded you last year during the trading you know, deadline and all that other stuff when teams try to pick up te- uh, other players. Why didn't Dallas trade you? I, I, I never not, understood that. I'm not sure. Never got to the – I had to agree to be traded with the, the no, uh, no move clause. Right. And, uh, Did they ever was, come to you at all? No, I was waiting. Uh, you know, we, we talked. Uh, he said he was going to entertain offers, but it never got to the point where I was asked to waive. So uh, – I don't know. I, I well, it turned no out idea. well. You made a boatload of money. You hit the free agency, right? And the Rangers swooped right in like 30 seconds after the period began and said, we'll take you. <laughs> That's Did right. You, right? You, you didn't a lot of money, too. You didn't consider any other team. The Rangers made you an offer that you couldn't refuse, essentially, right? Yeah, well, there was, it was a busy day. But, uh, you know, when the Rangers, when I was able to talk to them and, and sit down and figure out Just what Just out of curiosity, as Brad Richards joins us for a few moments here. When you and I met on a golf course, was I maybe a part of your decision to come to New York? <laughs> that maybe, you know, I was representative of the average New York guy, and you're like, that's the kind of guy I need to hang out with? I was really uh, excited about how much you were talking about hockey. See that? Morning, yeah, he yeah. knows that you love hockey. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, I can't get enough of well, it. Well, show him your picture. <laughs> you know, I played, that's me and goal, at Madison Square Garden. I've now played at the Garden more than you have. <laughs> and that's me stoning Boomer, not once but twice on breakaways. Yeah, he got me. Nice. He did get me. I oh. have to admit. Again, not once but twice.